Hello and welcome to Site Contact, the powerful Facebook autoresponder that will let you grab leads from your web pages and then send message broadcasts on Facebook direct to their inbox. So let's see how it works. To get started, you need to add a Facebook page to Site Contact. Here's a list of all the pages that we already have and this is my test copy so I've been working on it, testing it continuously. So we have a number of pages already there and if you want to add a fresh page, just click on add FB page and site contact will then send you to Facebook and you will have to give it permission and when you give it permission, you'll see a list of all the Facebook pages that are enabled for your account that you have admin access to and you can add any page by clicking on the add page button next to it like this one and the page is now added as you can see I can now work with the page so let's get started and understand how to work with the page after adding the page you need to decide which domain can it work with so on the on the options column right over here you will see a button which says whitelist your domain and this is where you need to tell site contact which domain is it allowed to grab leads from and you can put in all the domains here separated by a line so let's say uh, you have three domains just add all of them each on a line and then click on add domain and the domains will be added over here you will see them you'll see them listed at the bottom and if you want to remove any particular domain you can just click on delete this domain and the domain will be removed so once you're done with the domain whitelisting, I'll go back to the Facebook pages and show you. So I've set up a page for testing and you can see that I've got some whitelisted domains already and my leads will be grabbed only if they're coming from one of these domains and anyone who's outside these domains, if they try to sign up, the leads will not work. So you need to whitelist all the domains that you're working with. Coming back to the Facebook pages, here are the different ways by which we can grab the leads. So we've got four powerful options. The first is the checkbox plugin. Then we've got the customer chat plugin. Then we have the send to messenger plugin. And then we have the message us plugin. So there are four different ways that you can grab leads. And in a moment, I'm going to show you some web pages which implement each of these so that you will know exactly how they work. So let's get started with that. But before that, I will show you how to get the code to implement on your web page. So suppose you want to implement the checkbox plugin to your web page, click on get code next to the page that you want to work with and you will be asked to enter your website domain. So you can put in the website domain here for example and you will also be asked to select the plugin size. So select whatever plugin size you want and finally the code is right over here. So you can just click on copy and you can put this code anywhere on the page where you want to where, where you want the plugin to appear and the plugin will appear right over there now inside the software we have detailed training which will show you exactly how to implement each part of the code it's very easy even newbie can do it and if you have implemented any kind of form earlier an autoresponder form or any kind of web page online you can do this very easily using the training that we have inside the software that shows you exactly where to put what. But moving on, let's see another powerful feature of site contact and that is the welcome message. Now, whenever you sign up somebody, you might need to give them access to some resource. Maybe you've got a bonus, maybe you've got a free ebook, or maybe you just want to welcome them on board and say thanks to them. And you can do that right inside the welcome message. You can add any message you want. So here I have, so here I have put in a message thanking people for subscribing and giving them access to the ebook that I have. And of course you can put in absolutely anything you want, click on submit and it's going to be saved. And anyone who subscribes to your page, anyone who signs up to your page to receive your messages, they will get the first welcome message when they sign up. And now it's time to look at each type of sign up method in action. The first one is the checkbox plugin and you can use this plugin in your opt-in form so you can have a form with it there with the email sign up with the name and below there on the submit button you can have this text submit there here I have click on opt-in and you can embed the plugin right above the submit button asking people to check this checkbox to sign up 
and you can offer them some sort of incentive to sign up maybe a bonus or something just like you would offer them in a regular opt-in and once people click on opt-in they are now opted in successfully and they're signed up to your Facebook list your Facebook page list and then you can send them a broadcast the next is the messages plugin and you can put the messages plugin anywhere on the page you want maybe on your support pages maybe on your sales pages inviting people to message you and ask you something when people click on it they will be taken to Facebook messenger and they will be asked to sign in and send you a message right over there so right on sign up they will get the welcome message so i set up a welcome message earlier they've already got the welcome message and they can then start a chat with you and you can actually carry on the conversation right inside facebook and of course just like earlier anytime you want to send them a broadcast you can do that from inside site contact but coming back the next method is send to messenger using send to messenger people can send any kind of information any information on the page to their messengers and now as soon as they send to messenger button is clicked and they give you permission the page is sent to messenger and you can see here again that my welcome message that I sent earlier they've got it and they'll be able to download and I can then send them a message broadcast so it's just one click of a button for this case and finally we have the customer chat plugin and using this plugin when people click on chat now they'll be they'll be asked again to uh, go to messenger and then they can start a conversation with you and as you can see over here again I have they have got my broadcast message and I can then start a conversation with the page so you if you are at the other end you can start the you can answer the questions talk to the lead and actually grab the lead or maybe just take them wherever you want but again in this case too you can send them a broadcast and that is where we're going to next so we have grabbed the lead from the page using the four different methods and the lead is now with us and anytime we want to send the people who have subscribed to this page for example a message we'll click on the broadcast message section right over here and then select the page that you want to send the message to you can select you can send the message to the subscribers of multiple pages and that will work too so I've typed out a message offering them another free ebook and you can use this to give them any kind of information or maybe even discounts or special offers or give them some information about updates to your products or whatever you want you can communicate click on send now and they will get a message inside their messenger so when they log in into facebook for example i'm in the messenger right now and you can see i've got my second ebook right over here and the best thing is they will see a notification inside facebook too so if they're inside facebook they will see a notification in the messenger icon over here and they'll be able to go to the uh, they'll be able to go to the messenger page from here they'll be able to see your message and they'll be able to take action on it so as you know facebook is immensely popular and everybody is on facebook at all times so they'll see it on their mobile phones they will see it on the computer on the tablets no, no matter where they are and you know that people actually look at facebook messages so the opt-in rate is gonna be hundred percent the 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 read rate is gonna be near hundred percent and you're gonna get more clicks and more signups using this method than any other method but that's not all site contact gives you the capability to send scheduled messages so you can schedule a message for later send them a message when you want to send them even if you're taking if even if you are uh, on a vacation or somewhere you will be able to send them a scheduled message right from the broadcast messages section just click on schedule and select the time when you want to schedule it for example maybe on the 16th type in your message and click on schedule now and of course you need to select the page first click on schedule now the message is scheduled and when you go to schedule messages section you will see it there so here's the message I scheduled and it will be delivered to my audience on the 16th of March at 1 49 p.m. so this actually gives you the capability to send them a message in the future too and it works just like an autoresponder you can treat it just like an autoresponder and this is right now because it's 100 percent new technology people are not so immune to receiving facebook messages they're not so against receiving facebook messages like they are in email already you can actually reach out and make an impact and establish a personal 
line of communication establish a personal connection with your audience so guys this is what site contact does it's very easy to use quite simple if you've used an autoresponder this would be the simplest thing for you to use and you can get started today implement this on your websites grab leads and talk to them right now